Hi, today we will learn how to join sentences, two or more sentences, by noun clause. My name is Devo Rai and I am here to help you to learn spoken English. Though we can reply in simple sentences, but the varieties in sentences enrich your knowledge and it sounds audible, more audible, more enjoyable. So we will learn different kinds of sentences, how to use them, okay? He is an honest person, it is known to all. That he is an honest person is known to all. The boss said something, it is not clear. What the boss said is not clear. He will visit, the time is uncertain. When he will visit is uncertain. He said something, it turned out to be true. What is said turned out to be true. Ekhetre noun close to subject rupe vyabhoroy. You say something, there is no meaning in it. There is no meaning in what you say. Truth prevails in the end. This is a fact. This is a fact that truth prevails in the end. You made a mistake. This was evident. This was evident that you made a mistake. That you made a mistake was evident. Why did you leave the meeting? Tell me. Tell me why you left the meeting. What is his intention? I know. I know what his intention is. Where does he live? I know. I know where he lives. He says something. Listen to it. Listen to what he says. He did it. It was a fact. It was clear to all. The fact that he did it was clear to all. If we split a compound or a complex sentence, then we get two or more short sentences. These short sentences are called clauses. A clause contains a finite verb. The finite verb is the verb which can be converted into present, past or future tense. So it must contain a finite verb. When a clause acts as a noun, it is called noun clause. A noun can be the subject of a sentence or object of a sentence. Noun clause may be object of a preposition or a complement of be verb. It may be also a position to a noun or a pronoun. That he is clever is admitted by all. Here the clause that he is clever is the subject of the verb is admitted. Can you make out what he says? Here the clause what he says is the object of the sentence object of the verb make out if we ask the verb with what or whom then what the answers we get are the object of the verb okay i believe that he is innocent now ask the verb what i believe i believe that he is innocent that he is innocent is the answer of what i believe so it acts like an object. So this clause that he is innocent is the noun clause. Because noun clause acts as a subject or object. He may not succeed. It is his great fear. It is his great fear that he may not succeed. Eketre, that he may not succeed is the complement of be verb is. The fact that he did it was clear to all. Eketre, that he did it is a position to a noun or a pronoun. So now you can understand when others are saying or using some complex sentences in their speech or in their conversation. 
and you can also use them in daily conversation it brings variety to your speeches okay if you like this please subscribe my channel and share it with your friends so that i can upload more and more videos for you the links of other videos are given in the description box you can check them also put your comments below and press the bell icon if you want to get instant notification whenever i upload a video thanks for watching and listening this video